Hi guys, I hope you could. This is a short recap of episode 88 of Sieve and Lan, which premiered on the 28th day of April 2023. But dear viewer, I must remind you that previously, Tanya had attempted to escape. You'd remember that she had regained her conscious as Major Yak had assaulted her. Now, she was trying to escape and the car sped into the clinic. But you'd remember that in the clinic, they were shooting the talk show. Then the car ran uncontrollably to the clinic and this shocked everyone. Sadly, this untimely catastrophe left a lot of people injured, including Z. Well, while everyone was confused, Alexa was able to spot that Tanya was one of the people who were injured. She was badly injured, but the only person she could recognize at that time was Esther, her son. Guess what? Mayor Yak was one of the people who were also injured and Jatis was able to recognize him. At that moment, his men ambushed the whole clinic and took over. On the other side, Marvin is trying by all means to get to Ivy. And Ivy is informing him that you know what? There's actually trouble. The whole clinic is surrounded by people wearing army clothes. Mayor Yak ensured that Everyone's phones are confiscated to not allow external communication. He soon thereafter discovered that there's actually a live streaming going on and he then used it to his advantage to, to communicate with the police to, to inform them that if they will make a move, some of the people that are held hostage will lose their lives. Well, shockingly, Ivy was also pulled out of the car and then she was put in the clinic amongst those that are held hostage. There was also a possibility that Tanya could suffer from brain damage or suffer brain damage if she is not attended to. Well, this led to Mayor Yag approving that there must be an operation on her. But Alexa has no confidence. She is not a neurosurgeon and also there are no hospital staff members to help her. Then we saw Vanessa volunteering to assist her. On the other hand, Esther was very angry as Mayor Yag became very lustful towards his sick mother. He had to be removed from where everyone was and Shady was the only one who can be able to cool him. Well, by a miracle, Tanya's surgery was a success. And then it was time for Alexa to also help Mayor Yak, who was very insisting and stubborn. Then he argued with Chattis and then he shot Chattis. We are not sure of whether he's alive or not. After finding out about Mayor Ziag threat, Marvin decided not to go to the clinic and he went straight to Verna and informed him that his wife is in the clinic, but also informed him that let's not go to the clinic because if we happen to move any by clothes, he's going to attack people. On the other hand, Bonita screams hysterically and people believe that she has a problem with her appendix. Well, Dr. Sudesh is attending her and she informs him that you know what i actually have a plan so just pretend as if you're taking me to theater well what do you think about this episode i actually loved it and it prompted me to record my first ever recap well forgive me about the lack of quality i love you so much and stay blessed next time i'll do better